Hello everyone, welcome to another Plutonium Guy Plays video. Today I am in Roblox Islands and I'm going to be showing you guys how to make an industrial copper farm. So you're going to need a drill, which I didn't have in my inventory. Um, you're going to need, anyway, already the drill, a bolt factory mold, five conveyor belts, a copper press, an industrial smelter, and three coal totems, as well as a pickaxe in case you mess up. You know, I mess up a lot. So this drill right here, you put this directly onto your copper thing, so you just click right there boom you have it placed down once you activate that with coal it'll start drilling rather than you just mining this it drills infinitely and you get so much more copper from it it's very profitable very very profitable but to activate it you just take one of your conveyors and one of your lovely totems and you just put it right there boom shakalaka no worries you got it activated and everything already you take another one of your conveyor belts and boom shot oh i put it wrong that's awkward uh you take another one of your conveyors and you just turn and you just put it right there and then you take another one because why not you know just put a little space and then you take another cold totem and put it there then you're going to need your industrial smelter and you just plop that industrial smelter right on down you know just smack right there uh the drill has started now so it is making this stuff the industrial smelter will start producing ingots of the copper as well but once the drill is started, it makes stuff incredibly fast. Like, look at how fast it's making it. It's like maybe like three every second. Not every second. Every one every three seconds. Jeez, that was hard, guys. I'm sorry. But then the industrial smelter makes it pretty fast as well. So then you're just going to take another one of your conveyor belts. You're going to take this lovely copper press right here. You need this. This is like the most important part of this entire build. And then I already have the chest placed down. But... To configure the copper press, you go into it, and you need to make a bolt factory mold and put it in there. They are very expensive. Um, this entire rig is actually very expensive. I think there's like a total of like nine sticky gears needed, um, and a lot of, lot of stuff going into this. Lots of coins. But yeah, so this is an expensive thing, but it pays off very quickly because each of the bolts that it makes is worth 200 coins. And you'd think to yourself, 200 coins isn't that much. But then when you realize that it's making a lot, like the rate that this is making bolts is probably a lot faster than you'd think. I would dare say that it's probably a bolt every minute and a half. So if you're making... A 200 coins every minute and a half that's a lot of coins per day i can't do that exact math in my head right now but you know that's a ton of money especially if you're just like afk all day you can do that very quickly and then i forgot that you needed this cold totem right here that way this gets activated as well so we're, we're gonna ignore that but you know it needs to be done you need all three of these steel totems not steel totems cold totems this is a very expensive but very worth it rig um it was given to me by my great friend gray j6 and i will unfortunately be returning it but i did want to show you guys how to build this um and now i have this lovely copper bolt you know just put it in here it's beautiful and lovely i have it right here and i'm going to go sell it to the mechanic in the hub because it is totally worth it guys i did that much work right there like not much at all like very little in fact it will just got me 200 easy coins very simple very very simple to do you just go talk to jack in the hub you say hey i have a copper bolt you're like i like to sell it and you go ahead and sell it and boom shakalaka you've got 200 extra coins real quick you can also sell these i'm gonna go ahead and sell all of these too um they're not nearly as valuable but you know if that's what you want to do and you if you can't get the copper press but you just you happen to have the drill you know that gets you a lot of money too it's not it's no cheap boat process i promise but yeah anyway guys uh do what these signs say real quick sub and like sub to plutonium guy plays and like the video uh, my friends jake 17 b3 and gray j6 did this during the previous islands video make sure you go check that out all right so buys back to over here so this rig it's pretty small actually you do need to place it on one of your copper things that you already have like a copper island i believe they're called is how you do this it's the only way to do it you put that on there i believe that it does not work on the gold ones if you get a gold one um but you can still drill a ton of copper um as i was saying earlier the copper press is not necessary you can still make copper ingots that are chilling right here like they're, they're pretty valuable too. It's six a piece rather than 200 a piece, but it's still a very valuable process. Like, I would say that it's worth it. This whole thing, it, it's very expensive. I've said that plenty of times, guys. It's very expensive, but it 
profits back very quickly. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if you did, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe because it's super duper helpful to my channel. I really appreciate when you guys do that. Um, if you did not enjoy this video, I'm sorry. Um, but if you did, guys, I, I said this already, but be sure to leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see everybody in my next video.